Hi, I'm Mike. And I'm Terry. We are full-time treasure hunters and resellers. We work hard. And we play hard. We travel the Northwest buying storage units as well as scouring the United States for liquidation merchandise. Our 20 years of experience has created a passion for reselling and has allowed us to spend time with our family and enjoy recreational and travel around the world. We believe laughter is the medicine of life and we are here to share it with you. Please join us on this journey and keep laughing with Mike and Terry's Retail. Hey guys, Mike and Terry here. Oh snap, look at that. Back with you again today. <laughs> oh man. Hey, welcome back to our channel guys. We appreciate you guys coming in every single day. The amazing comments that you always leave. <laughs> yes. And uh, hey, welcome to the Mike and Terry Coffee Crew. The Mi I love I am it. loving that, you, you guys. You guys are cracking us up. And we haven't figured out the design yet. But we were talking about it, and I think we're going to have shirts that said that say M and T Coffee Crew. So yes. that's in the works. I know we've been talking about having shirts made. They are coming. Um, it hasn't been the easiest. We've been in communication with a couple of different companies, and we're just trying to work out all the details. We so are. We're, we're, getting, we we're know, getting close. We're getting close, though. When we know, you guys will know. Yes, so. it is getting close. So welcome back, everybody. If you're not subscribed and you want to. Stick around and have some fun, have some laughs, see if you can learn a thing or two. And maybe even hit that buy subscribe yourself button. A new shirt. Buy yourself a new shirt. <laughs> oh, what? One more thing. What? Entries for this year's name, family name. Um, keep them coming. I know I haven't replied back to any of you guys, but rest assured, any of you that have emailed your entry in, we do have it. Yes. We've read it. Some of them are absolutely hilarious. It's going to be a very tough choice, um, but keep sending them in. I know. You, they, they are really bringing in some really funny, oh my gosh, some funny. I, you know, I, you, I wish that some of these people just lived closer to us and we could hire them on as staff. And we could just blow this whole thing open. I oh, mean, they man. are just hilarious. They are. So okay. send, your, send your entries to MikeTerry'sResale at gmail.com. Okay. And I'll put a little thing in there. Put a little thing All in right. there, and that is... What do we got going on here? Get a gift card. What so, do we have going on We... Here? And I got the right numbers today also, Mike. All right. <laughs> okay, so we are going to do, do today, again, two pallets for you guys. Two of these because we're just not enjoying them. You guys are enjoying them. You're telling us. So let's see what we got. And we really like it when we get some that say with the unknown items in it. Because then we're all surprised what we're getting. Wow. So. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, I, I don't, don't want to unwrap it yet. all the way. So shipping fees, the whole bit, combined shipping it was. $332 we paid for this, this big pallet to be delivered to this location. <laughs> they say it retails $498. I will tell you that it's gonna retail probably more than that, just by what I can see from him cutting open. There's 13 items on here, which is gonna break down to $25.53 per item. So we will get a total for this one and how much potential profit we're going to make off of that projected profit. I like to say the word potential, but... It's for, potential profit. Now I'm getting more confused. There's just too many P's right We've here. We've got projected call, sales. I'm just going to start calling it the PP. <laughs> this is a family channel. Well, We've got projected sales with a potential profit. P.S. I love you. Okay, you know that that profit area. <laughs> All right, guys. Poor Mike. It's gonna be a long day. Okay, Mike. What do? Ooh. Ooh. We got we got some pretty good looking stuff going on here. Oh my gosh, this is exciting. All right. I would love to say that looks like an ammo case back there, but I know it's not. But right. I, what is that metal looking cabinet We're back there? We're gonna start with it. Okay, wow. what do you got? Holy smoke! This is a lot heavier than it looks. I got it. You got it? Yeah. I didn't. I mean, I didn't expect it. 
That's it's that faux marble. Yeah, that's actually faux marble. Is that real marble? Man. You know, some of them like to hear stories um, about our lives. Semi coming in right now? I don't think we got a truck coming in. I hope we don't have a truck like a coming, in, coming right in, in right now. Um, this is a cool little table. This is a very cool little table. And, you know, I'm going to share one little story oh, here. Story time. It was back in the... When, why, man, there's a lot of stories, too. My grandparents at one point owned... Um, a marble company. That's the story. So, that's all. <laughs> man, they're going to reach through the screen and slap you. They want to hear the story now. <laughs> I don't have a story because I was a little one. <laughs> There's no story. She's just letting you know that they did own one of them. Anyway, hey, metal frame, marble top. Um, this is probably, Poor Mike. <laughs> what, 25, 30 bucks? It is pretty scratched up, though. It but, is. I'm going to call it $25 right it's there. It's a quality built table, mm -hmm. though. Um, no, it's even more quality. I got to go right Check to this. Check this out. Guys, I got to get this out of the way. Oh, my God. I got a coffee new. table. Coffee table, you I guys. I have a coffee table right there now. No more spilling coffee. Oh, I want to try it out. But then you're always gonna be walking onto my side of the camera. So now you want to switch sides? Wow. That's a pretty wow. cool coffee table. That is so cool that I'm yep. gonna get this now. And then we can just remember my grandfather too there, okay? He was a funny man, wasn't he? Alright. We're okay. Okay, uh basic three shelf bookshelf. These are inexpensive guys. We get about 15 bucks out of these if they're not damaged. Um, but it looks like it's new and it's good. I'm gonna try to get this off here. Okay, I'll take this little guy. Because it wasn't taped in, so let's see what we got. Oh, just one of the shelves, the shoe shelves is usually what we call it. Just one of the two shelf shoe shelves. Two, two shelf shoe shelf. Say that again. Say it's that a again. shoe shelf? <laughs> two shelf shoe shelf. That's a shoe shelf. Shoe shelf. Try it. Like a shoe chef. What's that? The seashore? The sea se seashells on the seashore? You know? Oh my. Oh, this isn't what I thought it was, you guys. I already know what this is. Damn. I've sold some of these before. These sell oh, good. Hold on, hold on. Stand it up. Ready? I was looking inside. Bring it back. It's a little wine fridge, you guys. Wow. These sell really well. I bet you somebody probably just used this for a holiday. Even. For the holiday season. Whirlpool. And then they took it back. One, two, three, four, three shelf? Try to count my shelves are in there. First we had a shoe shelf, now we got a three shelf. Oh man, there's too many shelves. All right, let's slide this. Let's put it back here on this table. Okay, that's not no bar, but that's no, just a cereal. cereal. Okay. We can look it up pretty easy. Yep, I'm gonna, right. I'm gonna look this up. All right. This is yeah, awesome. I need to know what the, they're not. What this is, real quick. They're not worth a lot of money, you guys. We'll probably get. I'm gonna say that's see. probably pre-owned, so we're probably gonna get fifty or sixty dollars out of it. Cool. Okay, guys. Sorry, we had to take a brief break there. We were having a cell phone <laughs> malfunction. <laughs> We still don't even know what's going on. We actually had to restart the phone to make it stop. I don't know what it was. But anyway, why we did that was so funny. <laughs> I'm thinking the, the technical part we're having with this new phone has been quite um, an entertaining thing. Where's the wheat? So, beverage cooler, you guys. $280 at Target. It is on sale right now today for $240. You're gonna want so that. So we're calling you're, it what? You're gonna bucks? want that here this summer. So we need to put a coffee bar in here, and we need to put that here for during the summer. This thing is awesome, you guys. That's what I. Okay. That's what I think. All right. Okay. So you can also put that on like a hundred dollar bill too. You can just bring a jug of ice water. <laughs> All right. What do we got? What do you call it? A hundred dollars? Yes. Hundred dollars in our pocket. Guys. Okay. So there you are. Um. Folding table, we've been getting quite a few of these. They're all 
um, damaged, this side is good. damaged in one way or another, but we're still able to sell them. We have had um, one good one. There's another This one right here. here has got a broken corner right there. I don't know if you guys can see it or not, but we can still get $25 out of this, even damaged. Even damaged. And All right. Because everyone, people just put tablecloths on it. You ready? You got it? Yep, I got it. Oh, man. Good thing you had your oh, coffee on the new coffee down table. Now. I know. Four cube organizer. What is this scope? Oh, these are the. This is one of the big ones with the thick. Um, oh, the sidewall. Thick. Okay. Does it, now it does not include the, the storage bins. It does not. This one is fifty dollars at Target, okay. so we'll sell it for twenty-five. 25? Provided there's no damage All corners, right. uh, not missing this the hardware. This is a really good one. How many did we just get? The one. Just one. Okay. <gasps> Oh, this man. is pretty cool to have. Oh, I don't know where, gosh. but I feel like somebody, like one of our adult children, could use this, or we could use this, or our, somebody could use this. I feel like somebody will be able to use this, and they I will give us like twenty-five dollars for it. <laughs> you guys, oh, okay. we just crossed in to the tropic zone. Why is it? Why is it the tropic zone? Because Ooh, we where got are we going? a ten, is it a ten foot? Thirteen. Oh my gosh, a thirteen by thirteen pop-up gazebo, guys. Okay, let's see what this one is retails. Wow, this and it's Coleman. Coleman um, it re sells really, really might well. Have to redo it one more time. Okay. Sometimes wow. when you're going upside down, it just does not want to scan as well. Here, I'll get it. No, nope, does not want to work for me. I'll get it. You get it. Let's see. What do you got? Ta-da! You don't got it. He does got it. Darn. $160 at Target, guys. <gasps> wow. Wait, let me actually click on it because sometimes the price change. Boom. That was for you, baby. You know what? Hold on. Boom! Oh! Okay. 160. So, Boom. Eight, what do you think? 80 or 100? Would you, you know, sell this for? We'll probably try for 100 because it's Coleman. And it's the beginning of a season coming. Granted, it's still winter. What we but need, you all know what I mean. Spring's around the corner. What we need to look at. See, that's. <laughs> it's this other zipper right here. There. Is it actually new? That is. Is that in sealed? It is sealed. Okay. How's your end? You know, it looks new, you guys. At this point in time, I don't see any fabric. All right. I will have to really? pull this all the way out yep. and inspect it oh. to make sure somebody didn't do oh, something no. sketchy. Take the fabric. There are people, unfortunately, and that's that's part of the reason why we have this uh, this deal going here, where people are sending in their their um, entries for the name of the family for this year. Yes, because the McNasties they're gone. They're gone. We made them pack their bags and and sent them out. We need we need a new family now. All right. Okay. What do we got? I see some good boom on there, Mike. Or tape. I think they're going to get a little impressed here. I think I'm about to come unglued here in a minute. <laughs> Not for that. Oh, Not another, that. another so, three shelf. Yes. Bookcase. Is that, that's the same as the other one. See here. There you go. A three. Yep. And is it the same? It is. So the cool thing about it is. And how much was this one? Well, I think we get about 15 out of those. Okay. So let me add that one up. Yeah, that's what you told me, 15. Now these well, I got. usually get 15 to 20. These are the three shelf uh, metal wire oh, shelf. Oh, yes. These sell and really remember well. the Voss, the Voss water yep. bottles. So these always sell really fast. Okay, 20 bucks. It's not factory sealed. We'll have to make sure that all those little plastic clips are in there that hold the shelf. Definitely. Off. All right, let's get this down. Uh, uh, let me get, I got it for you. Hold on. That's not what I was saying at all about. 
Oh. All right, ready? I can't see up that far. All right. Yes. Oster stainless steel microwave. Man, this looks like... It has been retaped, but I can see that the microwave is in the bag in here, guys. So I'll have to pull it out, check it, test it. If everything's good, this is a $40 bill. All right. Where'd my knife go? I got it. Here. You can't just come in here taking off with my knife. Okay, where's your knife? <laughs> there. Take that. <laughs> hey, you hands off my knife. All right. Get this out of the way so we can bring on the boom. And this is not it. But it is a clock. My... Wow, this one doesn't, doesn't look broken. Clock. Doesn't seem broken. Let's see. Yeah. The hand's bent a little. But it has a resistance, you know, it won't just flop and, all around. And the hour hand just turn turned. with it. Uh oh. It, right here it's bent. See? That... There, now try it. I think that's yeah. the winner, you guys. We're gonna have a winner. That's this probably, will be twenty dollar bill. I'm gonna say fifteen to twenty. Yeah, I bet you this is forty to fifty retail. Let's let's take a quick glance. Forty yeah. to fifty retail. Yes, she forty said. to fifty. Wow. What was that? That didn't sound good. <laughs> let's see. It sounds beautiful. Forty dollars. So twenty dollars for this. Okay, what do we got, Mike? Well, oh, is it good? Well, is it bad? We had those fall off. Is it comical? So, I want to save this for last. Okay, what does this? Oh, that's what that goes to. All right, that is. I know what it is. It's the knob. Yeah. So, so we're so missing we'll, one knob. A little busted up. Okay, one knob we're missing. And there's the center leg. Center leg. The bottom. Oh boy. We're gonna have to pick it up. We don't want to drag it because no. it's already scratched. Tip it my way. Ready? Don't, don't break the legs, legs off. Get your end. I got it. You left your end up. Ready? Ready? Yep. Oh boy. More pieces falling. Lift hey, let's just show you, you guys. Show you this way. There it is. Set it down. And let's see what's actually in here. So it's a wooden There's TV pieces stand. In coffee, here. coffee, coffee. <laughs> How would the coffee table work, you guys? I thought you were saying this is coffee, like the coffee, like a coffee table, a coffee bar, coffee. <laughs> Oh, this thing is... Shelf is falling. Doors I, are falling. <laughs> I think this thing has some problems, you guys. Oh, <laughs> it's falling apart. <laughs> we will look into it and see if we can repair it. This is really cool. <laughs> <laughs> you shot one door, the other door Have you guys seen the movie um, Inspector Gadget? <laughs> This is like the Go Go Gadget gonna, TV stand. You're gonna sit on it. Well, I'm showing everybody how strong it is. Yeah, it's so strong. Doors are falling, shelves are falling. Okay, let's let's move this thing out of here so we can get to this because this is where it's at. That is where it is at. Okay. The here. funny thing of it is, guys, this box right here we believe is major boom, and Excuse we didn't that. even know it was on this pallet. Well, we're not gonna have enough room. I have plenty of room. To bring this in and open it up. Oh boy, you didn't tell me that. So, hang in there, guys. Take this out. He said, "Let's move." We are moving. We have we have good reasons. We think good reasons to move well, with the go go gadget. All right, just set it. Down. Okay, guys. Here it is, the one we were waiting for. Okay. So first off, you're not going to be able to see it, but it says one set, five pieces, gray finish. Oh my gosh, I didn't know it was gray finish. Gray finish <laughs> plus dark gray cushion. And what it is, is we're going to put a screenshot in for you guys right now. Got it. Hold on, right now. <laughs> 
probably flip it so they could see the picture. But they've already seen the screenshot, so it doesn't matter. Um, this is factory sealed. This has never been opened. The tape has never been cut on this box. <coughs> what? I want to see it myself. Oh, you do? Well, we got to flip it back over then. Okay, so I need to know how much are we going to sell this for? We are not going to sell it. You guys, I'm just going to go lay down on this thing. <laughs> and... <sighs> Ta-da! Look what I got in a pallet, you guys. <laughs> okay. You cannot return it. I know you may want to return it some days. There is no returns. Sorry. Here's the deal, guys. We got a deal. About a week ago, we got the wicker sectional that was missing the corner piece. I'm sure you guys have all seen that video. Um, that, was, that was the one that I just quoted out, the $1,427. We, at this point, have not found... There's no we in this. The center piece <laughs> for it. Um, we've been looking around a little bit, but there's it's... no we in this again. Okay, I've been looking around. <laughs> I'm just not going to talk anymore. <laughs> I voted that we should keep this sectional set with the table and get rid of the wicker. I vote that we should keep the wicker and find the middle piece. So, how about we put a screenshot of both on here and they tell us. So in the comments below, you guys tell us which one should we keep. Remember, we have to buy additional parts for the other one. Remember, the other one's a lot cooler looking probably than this I one. I don't know, this is pretty amazing. <laughs> We're gonna take a quick break, you guys. We're going to pop this thing open and see what we're dealing with. We'll be right back to you. All right, guys, we got all the tape. I think all the tape cut. We are going to lift this lid off so we can all see it at the same time. We have not peeked at it yet. And we did find it online, $899. So $900 for this. Oh, wow. Okay, so dark gray cushions. How many cushions do we have? Um, what's that photo show? I feel like Three. we don't, I feel like we don't have the whole set here. Let me take let me look at the screenshot. Um You should have four big cushions and three back cushions. Um we got three back cushions. And you got one, two, two. Oh, I don't want to throw There's four. another one down here. Okay. I got something over here too. Plus, yeah. we're supposed to have yeah. a lounge cushion. You have a cushion on your end? Yeah. That's the four cushions. So the lounge cushion is, is two just, separate? Yes. Okay, so we got all the we cushions. Got four cushions. And a whole lot of wood wrapped in plastic, you guys. Oh my gosh. I mean, look at this. This is the table. There's packets and packets of wood. That's the table, actually. Oh my god, that's heavy. So, seat, seat. I believe that this is the whole kit. You know, I have no idea until we would actually get into this more. Yeah. I it believe looks, it's the it whole looks, kit. It looks like it's the whole kit. Wow. So if that is, that being, that being said, this is a nice gray and the wood is supposed to be the gray finished wood. $900 set. That is a huge score. Hypothetically. Okay, we may keep You're trying this. to talk me into selling it, guys. We may keep this. I don't know yet. This thing's awesome. Hypothetically, it is awesome. Um, how about we just have both? One <laughs> out front, one out back. Then it's a win-win. Do you feel like going gray today, or do you feel like going um, bamboo wicker whatever style today? So, okay. you know, I've made we the comment. We can sell this for. I've made the comment many times, you guys, about you're not going to get rich selling liquidation. Not with someone and like me. And you're really not going to when you keep everything. <laughs> not when you have a wife. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. So. If you want to so, get into this business, make sure you're single. <laughs> okay. Where are we at? Let's say 
Let's say we're gonna. Hey, you we're can gonna, you can find yourself single in twenty seconds, Mister. Let's, let's say we're gonna sell this. What where where would we be on this pallet? Um, that's why I was gonna ask you. If it's nine hundred dollars, we could easily get very fast five hundred dollars. Five hundred dollars. Five hundred. We're, we're just gonna say five hundred. Five hundred. Oh, by that's the way, not a five. Boom! 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 <laughs> that's what that was. That's major. That's like some of the biggest boom ever. That is. All right, so what do we got here? How about we'll add this up, and before we start cutting open the next one, we will give you the numbers of this one. We'll be right okay. back. All right, guys, we are back. Pallet number two is in place, but first. First. She wanted to tell you about I that. I want to tell you the numbers you here. You do that. I got to so, get the coffee. Okay, you get the coffee. The potential. Did I do it right? Potential. The potential. Um... Sales, profits, not the profit. No. <laughs> Seriously. You were Potentially, right we are going to sell everything off of that last pallet. <laughs> That's my kind of wording. Yep. For nine hundred and fifteen dollars. Yes. If we keep. Wait. Uh oh. Back it up. Back Hold it up. Hold on. Potentially, we could get nine hundred and fifteen dollars out of that pallet. We paid. $332 for a potential profit of $583. Okay. So $583 will be our profit, but we're looking at $915 back out of the whole thing to start all over with. All right. So if we decide to keep that section up and we sell our patio set at home and swap those out, we could get $300 for our patio set. That would be a potential profit of 383 out of that pallet. So still a win. It's still a win. We would get still that new patio set and $383 profit wow. out of it. We All would right. get a total of 715 back out of it. What are we gonna get so, out of this? This one right there. So that way, if we got some thinking to do, are we going for 383 profit or 583 profit? We're going to That's only a $200 it. difference, so we probably will end up keeping that, that section up. Hey, happy Father's Day, babe. Gonna, I think you wanted that, didn't you? Look at this wood. I, I, you know what? I get a dirty crock pot from you. Oh, don't worry. I know, that I know, I know vase flowers, and you get a Dell laptop. A uh, Ninja Air Fryer double basket. What do you mean I got? That yes. went to our kitchen. That's what it sounds like when you say I spent all the money. I'm like, it's not for me, it's for the house. Oh, it's going to be oh. a long day, guys. Oh, boy. How many of you women are out there agreeing with me going, mm-hmm, yep. And the men are going, mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay, we paid shipping fees the whole bit to bring this right here to this location. $350. They say, here we go again, that retails $782. There is 15 items on that, which is going to break down to $23.33 a piece. Uh -oh. So let's see how much we can uh -oh. get out of this palette. Uh -oh. And then we're going to combine them all into one and see how much of a big profit can we make. That stuff falling. I hear it. Let's get that out of the way first. Oh, wow. What is this? this it's, a doll, the... it's a dollhouse. How do you know? Oh, wow. Because I looked at the manifest this morning. Okay, here. And there is unknown items again. Oh, my goodness. We even goodness. got some chunks of wood in here. Oh There's some goodness. unknown items on there, and I see one staring at It's literally staring at me. It's staring That's kind of cool. Where is it? It's this. This was an unknown. There's no eyes on that. It's the, right there. That's the eyes. Okay, here we wow. go. Wow. Okay, so this dollhouse, that is not on there. It's a wooden... Mm. How big is this? Kids' house. Includes four pieces. Only four pieces? Does it say about how big it is? Um, it's a mystery, you guys. Oh my gosh, it's the price on it's $130. Oh, this is, oh, hearth and hearth and hearth that and That is a very pretty, okay. oh my Kids gosh. Row house. Oh, here Doll it is, house. down here. I'm oh. reading upside down now. 20, 
27 by 11 by 27, approximately. So 27 high, 27 wide. Allegedly. Alleg <laughs> so about. I'll find out if April's watching our video or not. <laughs> so April, for you, April. April, if you are, you gotta leave us a comment now, girl. So, All right. there you go, 27 by 27. Okay, that's really cool. $130. What would we sell this for? Probably 50, 60 bucks. Dollhouses are actually kind of hard to sell, you guys. Except for we have had one buyer in the past who loves dolls. She's bought a bazillion of them from, I don't think she needs any more. No, but I think she's addicted to them. Is the thing. She loves dollhouses. She loves dolls. Let's see. Is it the brand new? Oh my gosh, you guys, look at that. Wow. That is ah, factory, almost not, <laughs> packed in there. So let's see, every little foam has something in there. Uh, yes, yes, there's all the little pieces, the boxes. So that is a very huge dollhouse. Wow. Papa, you are lucky you do not have a granddaughter who is like three years old because I would be like insisting that you would be putting this together for her. Yeah, she doesn't need it. No, she's a big girl now. She has so many doll houses as it is. All right. Okay, let's get that out right. of here. That took some work. Okay. So, are we ready? We are going... Item number... We're going $50 on that doll house. Item number, what is Let's this? see Super what we're going to add up now. Was that the first item? That was the first one. That All one right. is, oh. It's pretty beat up, you guys. It's a cool it little table. Um, it's brass legs with a little drink tray top. But it's this corn. This, this but you know what? It's pretty chewed up. Uh, a crafty person could do. You they can cover it with some peel. Peel it. How do you know what I was going to say? Ta -da! You totally beat me to the punch. Five dollars worth that. Or if you throw in a roll of peel and stick, now it's three. Five dollars for the day. We'll get it out of our way. All right. Somebody else can have the project. Basic six cube cubby organizer. That's about 20 bucks in our pocket. All right. You sure think that that box like that and something that cool would be just worth more money. But the, well, those are the cheap ones. The, I know. The real thin ones. Wow. Alright. I think we got... Oh, what hit me in the chest. I think we got a mystery box, guys. Do we? Yeah. Let's see. Does this say... Oh, my god. Let's gosh. open it up. This is so funny. Do you know what it is? Yeah. Should I read it? Yeah. It says, LOL Surprise... And here I said, oh my Ooh. gosh, when I read it. Is it but it's called LOL Surprise Oh My Gosh House. <laughs> oh. That's what made me laugh These even are more. Expensive. Oh boy, guys. So let me see. LOL. Well, what's weird is this just does this isn't like factory pack. It's not. Because this wouldn't be in a brown box. And no. This is really interesting. Why it's what are we missing? Right here, hold on. I don't know that we want to open this all the way. We're gonna up. have to retape it. it. Won't even Okay, well it appears to be brand new. There's the hardware, but what I wanted to see, there's instructions. The house, and all the pieces. Where's all the surprise stuff? That's I what don't, I don't get. Probably. Probably what? Down in there. Wood, 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 wood. I'm just standing wood. here quietly. Wood. That's all wood. So what were you gonna say? I was going to say, probably what we should do is tape it back up and flip it over and check the other it says, side. There's another. Oh. Because the way they have it packaged surprises. in here, Please do that. chances are it may not all be here. I'm thinking the surprises might be gone, which is going to make a difference in. It'll make a huge difference in surprise. the price.
That should at least give us the cure enough to flip it. Oh. oh. Okay. Well, I did that. No, I didn't. So, we'll make our own. Potentially, if this is complete. I don't know. This retails for two hundred dollars. We will sell this for. No, I think this is just the house, you guys. I think it's just the house right. also. We're good. Close it up. So for just the house, we're missing all of the surprises. Now this just changed from a two hundred dollar retail to. I apologize if that's really loud. About 125 so we will sell this for approximately $65. I now. think what it was is I think it came in a giant box and it probably had the house packaged Just, in one box. That was an how the inner house, box. Yep. And then it probably had all the surprises in another inner box. That one was so, taken. So let's see. So $65 now for that. All right. What do we, and that's, yes. This that looks like a uh, mess. This, this looks like a mess. Let's see, I can take one of them. That looks like a huge mess. It is a metal framed bookshelf, you guys. Here, I'll just put a screenshot in for them. The frame sticking out of the box. This, this appears that somebody attempted to put this together. Um, and then they gave up and they couldn't get it back in the box properly. So, we'll have to really look. Here's the hardware pack right here, and it is... It's called a ladder bookshelf. Yep. And it retails for... There's the hardware. The hardware is still fully intact. That's a good size. That's a really good size. There's one, two, three, four, five shelves. One, two, three, four, five. five. There. The real five question shelves. is... I think it's complete, but there's no guarantee we're actually going to have to pull it out. It's appearing to be complete. The real question is, did they pull it all out of the box and discover something was damaged, and that's why they took it back without ever attempting to put it together? Or, it was someone like me that pulled it out of the box and went, oh boy. And then how to repackage that went, oh boy. <laughs> so, it retails for $130 if that is complete. 65? 60, probably 60. 60? I can see a few little scratches. Okay, $60 it right. is. What do you got for us? We got... Can I hand that off to me? We're not going to pick it up. Okay. I mean, we can, I guess. Um, Five shelf bookshelf, guys. The same as all the... Uh, all the rest. Something is has gotten um, wet on. It's kind of sticky, like syrup or something. It is. It's not in the it's not, it's in, not in the package though. Hold that back in there then. Protect that. I'm gonna assume twenty five dollars though. That I'm gonna is. assume that this is new. We just sold one of these yesterday. Yep. We are out of stock on this. For twenty five, right? For twenty five dollars. I'm gonna Go ahead. grab this off here. Ready? You yes. just sold wait a minute, why is this one so light? It should not be that light. Let me see. Four trays. Um, and the rack. It feels about normal. TV trays. We've actually sold quite a few of these lately. Yeah, that feels, it feels about normal. Does it? Okay. Yeah. Man, I must just be getting strong. It's, you know, moving all this furniture around. Oh, You're I'm getting sure. ready for Tuna Town. For well, Tuna we Season. Long way. We gotta go through Halibut first, guys. Okay, you're getting ready for a barn door. And I'll tell you what. You so guys are gonna see some fishing videos this year. For those of you who do not understand all of this stuff, we're saying a barn door is a halibut that is big. Big halibut or big, big flat fish, and they lay on the bottom of the ocean. So if your depth in that ocean you're fishing is 500 feet, that's where you're catching that fish at, and you're fighting that fish 500 feet up. And he just isn't going to swim up towards you. He, fly, he goes like this against the water, fighting you, trying to go back down. So... Look at there, another bookshelf. This is a bigger one though, this is a wider one. It's only three shelves, but it's wider than the others. There you go. So, provided it's good, we're probably looking at 20 to $25. 
Um, I actually sold two dressers last week that matched this. They had the same color and same design with the metal base on it. So We're going I, 25. I may message that customer. They bought both of those dressers. Okay. I may message them and ask them if they're interested in this to match. Let's see what this is. All right. Two-step folding step stool. Interesting. It's in a box. But it must be brand new then, huh? Well, let's see what that brand is. See if that's really what is in there. Well, this and brand is not expensive. I do know that. No? No. Okay. And... It is... There's, there's, there's two, two of them, them in there. Three? Holy smokes, you guys! It says it contains four. Wow! This is like a clown car. And that's why I was kicked out because it says it contains four, but actually it only contains three. So we have three step stools. Okay. $20 a piece. How many items are we supposed to have in this pallet? Fifteen. Fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yes! So we got three. These were labeled one. as one item yeah. and we got three. So $20 a piece. Oh, Let's is that what them. we're going to get? That's what I'm going to do. Well, we'll just double check okay. it to make sure. Did you already, you no. didn't do it? Since these are a little taller and they're metal. They're aluminum. Aluminum, they might be worth a little more. Or not. These are $25 a piece at Target right now, guys. We will sell these for fifteen dollars a piece so without 15, blinking an eye. Forty, well, you you could still sit there and do twenty dollars a piece without blinking an eye. Probably so. So, um, now that you know, I'm gonna give that a boom just because of, for a maintenance. It is. Boom! Because we got three items for the price of one. That is awesome. That's a boom. Okay. That's a win right there. So Anytime you can see. do that. Hey, I should pick another box. I did good. <laughs> All right, you did good. Okay. All right. What do you got? I think that's... What? You know better than that. We could tell them some stories about that. We will. We'll share another story with them. Uh, man, what is a story time today? Another a garment wrap. Whoa. $15, $20. Uh -oh. About $20 we'll get out of this. Um... And they always sell. Sometimes they might take a week or so, but they always do sell. So twenty dollars for the garment wrap. Okay. They do sell. Okay. What do All we right, got guys. now? We got. I believe there's going to be two in here. Contains two pieces. Yeah. yeah. These are called a Parsons chair. They're a fabric covered dining chair. We've had the same set before. Not the easiest thing in the world to sell. So we'll get a screenshot in for you guys so you can see what they look like. Take a quick peek yep. here. And these are kind of a gold color. These are pretty cool because gold is also one of the new colors coming yep. back. We'll, we'll see. We'll get the screenshot in. I, If I remember right, the last time I had these... See. They retailed for somewhere around 200 bucks. All right, let's get a good look here. Oh, you're going to beat me because I got mini scanner. I'm going to try, but my scanner didn't, it didn't pick it up. Yours is probably going to pick it up. No. Oh, I got second chance. I think this is one of those brands that just, they don't come up. No, it doesn't. We'll get the screenshot in for you guys. I believe, off the top of my head, I think they were around two hundred dollars. So what would we get for that? Last time I sold them for seventy, okay. and it was not an easy sale. So we're going to these were a different gonna color. Them, we're going to count them seventy for right now with a question mark, and then when we're doing our final add up, we'll look those up. That did not sound good, my friend. That sounded used. And a used of it did. carpet shampooer, most of the time, is not a good item, you guys. No, no. $150 is retails for. Sorry. Let's redo that. 
one this one already. retails for 200 it's on sale for 130 I do so if it's new it's not new it's not I new. do appreciate this though the Ziploc bag with the assembly screws um, the there, owner, there the is owner, an odor coming out of here. The owner has black hair. Um, it is probably cleanable, you guys. We'll have to test it and make sure that it actually works. It's not but filthy, it's, filthy. It's not, they dumped the water out, which was very nice of It's them. not real bad. Um, but there is still moisture inside it. It's not real bad. When we say bad, you guys, some storage units we have gone into, you have actually seen the dirty water still in these. Or it's amazing what people a nasty do. mud layer inside the machine. That it's just it's it's just gross. So what what can we get out of this? Provided so it works. It, provided it works, up it's cleaned up because it looks like it was the the rental system they did. Literally, they wanted to clean their floors and they returned it. Um, sixty-five dollars. Sixty-five dollars. Yeah. Without right. without uh, hesitation, I could pull off sixty-five dollars. Let's see. All right. This is gonna be a mystery. Hold on. Okay. You saw it. I have. Yeah. No, this time, I have no idea. I'm hoping. This looks just like a box that I sold a few days ago. I'm hoping that it's the same one. No, it is not. Alright. Um. Okay. It's a table. You want me to bring it out? Yeah. Okay. Is it heavy? Yep. It's taped. Oh. I think it's another faux marble type table, you guys. It is. So people got, like it. We're seeing. What this kind of table is, this is designed to go on the end of your couch and it will actually butt right up to the armrest on your couch. I can't get all the packaging out right now. If you guys figure out what it is. Exactly. You know, this is $25 right there. $25? $25 easily. Did you scan it? No. Oh, it's going to be more than that. Uh, I, said, I thought you I said. It. Easy. I thought you scanned it. No, that's our resale. Oh. Resale twenty five dollars. Oh. Well, I don't think Stand we. Scan that. Does that one even have a thing? Let's find out for you. Come on, Mike. Here we it need, is, guys. Moment of truth. We need some boom. Eighty dollars at Target. Okay. Typically a hundred. Uh, why does it say tip? Oh, it's regular 100. It's on sale for 80. So we're gonna try 40. Why not? We're trying 30. But remember, so you are the furniture person, Mike's the not furniture me. guy. So I will post it for 40 and see what happens. If somebody offers me 30, maybe I'll take it. All right. All right. We got two items left. Let's see what we got. So I know what that is. Or what? the one behind it. But what's well, this course. one? This one is, I don't think we're going to pick it. It is a solid wood leg TV stand. Let's get them a screenshot. Let's see. Let's see. Um... This one's a little alarming. Not sure if this is going to be uh, new or what this one is, guys. The tape is pretty dirty, ooh. so we'll need to we'll need to check it. These stickers on here are really old. This thing's been laying around for a while, so we'll yeah. need to we'll need to make sure that it's actually new, exactly, and not anything damaged. Well, or I hope it is. It's really neat. It's black. There's their screenshot. Oh, two hundred and fifty dollars at retails for, and it's on sale for two twelve and fifty cents. I have one very similar to this so, posted right now. Uh, it's really neat. It is. What what I've learned lately is black TV stands are really hard to sell right now. Are they? 
Um, anytime we get a white one, they sell almost instantly, but the black ones are not selling. Okay. And I don't know why well, that I is. just ordered a palette that has two white ones on it. Yes. So you're in luck. Well, this is still a boom, though. Boom. Oh, and those chairs. Boom. Man. I got to remember to get the boom okay, in Okay, so here. how much? How much for that? What did it? What was the retail? Two fifty regular. Okay, we're gonna call it a hundred dollars. Okay, hundred dollar bill. Hundred dollar bill. Now this was okay. an unknown item. An unknown and item. Guys. We will share another story with you guys here. Let's see. We're gonna share a story, but then we're gonna go against our own rules. What are you doing? I'm trying to help you, but I'm failing. Is it heavy? No. So, that was just some weird this stuff. is a double door retro style fridge, you guys. It is the refrigerator, which you can't see because of the table, and the freezer. Before so, you open this, if any of you have ever watched the... Well, we'll just use storage wars. Um, it is very true about you be careful opening up your... Fridges or freezers inside a storage locker. That is just a no, you do not do it, preferably. Get it outside. Get first. it outside. Our very worst, worst experience. Gosh, you guys, you will never believe this. This is definitely part of the McNa McNasty family. <laughs> we bought the McNasty family unit, I think. So <laughs> we opened it up inside actually mike opened it up inside i was still in the hallway and it when wasn't he, a fridge guys it was a big freezer. tall and deep when freeze he opened it the smell oh my gosh and he shut the slam the door went running out we were out there with the manager still and i looked at steve the manager and i told steve you stop it i told steve i said if there's a body in there steve i said i'm abandoning this i'm done and it was frozen tilapia and vegetables that the people thought they could put ice packs at the bottom of the freezer and it would stay frozen. And on top of it, this was during the summer. Needless to say, the ice pack it probably in thought in eight hours and the dripping, wet, nasty smell that came out of there was unbelievable it was unbelievable it was unbelievable so, so we're hoping we don't have any smell like that here today guys or the mold don't ever put one in there away with the door shut leave the door it's open. gonna mold all right how's it how is it i don't know why it's so crooked though i think we're missing a foot missing a foot or we're gonna have to adjust it ready go Ta -da! look at that that's perfectly clean guys How's the bottom? It's still taped. Okay. So maybe they didn't use the freezer. Perfectly perfect brand, brand new, oh, guys. This is I don't, so cute. I honestly don't know that this has even ever been used. This may have just been a display in the store. I want it. This thing is cool, you guys. I'm going to guess. So this could go. This A couple hundred go. bucks. Let's this see. could go out by the cabana slash new patio set slash fire pit by your 20-foot pond. Wow. What? All of those things oh, you're saying. With all of your metal beer signs. Well, I have news for you guys. What's it, what does it retail for? We are selling this. Baby. No, we're not. What does it retail for? We are selling this baby. This is how far. Well, so far I've only found it in black, and it's three hundred bucks in black. Really? Oh, sorry. Here's Target right here. Three hundred and thirty at Target. Wow. Okay. Now that was for black. I don't know if it's same price for whatever for every color. Or and that's what. that's what's really strange. Is sometimes this thing is super super cool though. Uh, it does have some dents in it. Um, it's got a pretty good dent right here on the corner. This is the side that was exposed during shipping. I think it probably got hit with a forklift. Target is three hundred. Home Depot is four twenty-five. Well, 
$125 more if you go to Home Depot. For the I same found item. It. See? It's in red. I found it at Best Buy. I don't remember where it went. Well, no. Why would we go to Best Buy? For 600 bucks. Because so that's you... probably some random third party seller. Different size. And that's possible. Okay, so we might not have been looking at the right size. We don't even know. Does it say right on here? We're going to call it mm, dual door. No. We're just going to call it 200 bucks. Yep, you have my interest now. Interest This in is what? the 4.6. It's the interest. 4.6 in is $340 at Target. And it is, it's definitely a scratch, has some dents. So there is the new Very screenshot. Cool. Maybe what, 150 uh, 200. 200? 200. 200. It is like, it's brand new looking inside. $200, guys, right there. So, if not, I'm keeping it. This is going to be, forget that, forget that beverage fridge. I want this fridge for well, my we patio. we weren't keeping that one either. Oh. Man, we're not going to ever make any money. I just want to retire. <laughs> oh. okay. okay, guys, we're going to do a bunch of math real quick and some numbers, and we'll be right back. All right, we are back, and give us a number. I have no clue what's even going on. I know he has no idea. So she was we, over there. we paid. Da, 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 da. <laughs> we paid for this pallet three hundred and fifty. Uh, we could sell everything back out of this pallet for seven ninety five, which would be a profit of four forty five. Now let's combine both pallets together. Both pallets together, we paid six hundred and eighty two dollars. If we keep that sectional from the last pallet. We could sell everything for $1,510 for a profit of 800, potential profit, $828 and a new sectional patio set for Mike. 800 and something and we only paid how much? 682. So we still come out a couple hundred bucks ahead. About $150 ahead roughly. Okay. And a new patio set. But how much would we make if we sold that? If we sold it? Add another $200, oh. huh? No, sorry, that's our profit right there. Eight twenty eight is our profit, don't confuse me. I? You're confusing me. So if you keep the patio set, then our profit your profit is eight twenty eight. Oh. No, if we sell, sold it. If you sell it. And keep our old one. Yes, 1028 is your Ooh, profit. We're selling it. Your profit's 1028 or if you keep it, your profit is 828 We got a lot of stuff to sell. So, I say we keep it. See how much I love you, dear bejeebies. <laughs> Why is it? What's it? Oh, goodness. Okay, guys. I will sacrifice this red fridge. And we will keep your your piece of patio furniture. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Maybe someday we'll let you know what he acts ever innocent. He's we have got for this. You guys can't see it all. I know you've seen all these things come out on videos, but we've got patio furniture stacked up everywhere. As of right now, let's we're going with we'll keep that one. Oh, okay. But then we may get another one next week where that one Never this know. one's gone. See, in my head, I already owned it, and I'm done with it, and I'm ready for a new one. <laughs> Oh, guys, we appreciate you hanging in there all the way to the end. I know this is this is this probably is long our longest one. video ever. I know. So we really appreciate it. Keep your comments coming. Make sure you tune in every day. And if you haven't sent in your entry for the family name, make sure you uh, get that emailed in. And all right, guys. Here we go. There Time it is. Time for a cold one, Mike. Amazing. All right, guys. Bye-bye. Keep laughing.